All right, guys. So I have put around uh, 200 rounds through my Dan Wesson ECO. Um, I had two magazine malfunctions. Um, I think that's okay for the break-in period. Um, so I'm going to show you the disassemble and uh, my way of preventing the uh, scratch you get on here. Uh, some people refer to it as the, uh, the idiot scratch. Um, so mine did not come with the disassembly tool. I don't know if that was just me or I don't know. So I just use a plastic po uh, plastic coated paper clip. Uh, so there's no magazine in it and it is clear. Um, so let's get started. There is a little hole up in the front. I don't know what, how, how well you can see that, but this fits right into there. And now what we're gonna do, we're gonna line up the slide lock with this little notch. And when I do that, I'm gonna be pushing on this to get this pin to pop out. So, we'll line it up like that, give it a push. All right. And then this piece slides out, should slide out. And then this part, you have to push this part, lay it flat. And then a little wiggling, it's still really snug. So here is the breakdown of the Dan Lesson ECM. <clears throat> Uh, disassembly is just as easy. Just do it reverse. Now when I'm putting it back together, I actually like tension on here. So I take this piece out and just lay that flat. Uh, so for reassembly, you need to pull this part back just like that and push it down just slightly so that this hole will line up with this hole and there won't be any issues. So you just reassemble and you see how there's the hole straight through. And just line this up. And then line that right on top. Then you pull this back and line it up again and then give it a good and that prevents you from rotating it up and creating that scratch. So, there it is. All reassembled. And the way to check to see if it is, in fact, reassembled, you can take a pencil with a rubber eraser and just push that right there. And then when you pull the trigger, you know how the firing pin works. So, here we go, guys. Dan Wesson ECO breakdown. Have a good one.